it isn't always easy to accurately judge the speed and distance of other road users. Front Assist uses the radar to monitor the traffic situation in front of the Golf and helps identify hazards early on. For instance, a driver that changes lanes without checking can unexpectedly force another driver to brake. If Front Assist detects an impending hazard, it intervenes. It alerts the driver, but at the same time also prepares the brakes for emergency braking. The ensuing jolt of the brakes provides a clear signal to act. If the driver fails to apply the brakes adequately, Front Assist boosts the braking pressure to prevent a collision. If the driver does not brake at all, Front Assist steps in. In the best case scenario, it prevents an accident or will at least substantially mitigate the consequences. Front Assist monitors the surroundings like an attentive front passenger with their own brake pedal. Even in stop and go traffic on urban roads, Front Assist monitors the surroundings. Because the city emergency brake function is active in urban traffic at speeds of up to 30 km per hour, here too the radar detects the impending hazard and the system automatically brakes. Everything turned out fine. The city emergency brake helped prevent a rear end collision. A camera in the interior mirror scans the lane markings on the road from approximately 65 km per hour. Lane assist also works if, as here, only one of the road markings is visible. What's more, if it detects two road markings, lane assist will keep the golf in the middle of the lane if requested and can even learn the preferred driving line. Here the driver is distracted and the car is about to wander out of its lane. But lane assist is always one step ahead. Before the golf strays out of its lane, it steers the car in the right direction. Of course, the driver can override the lane assist function. If he deliberately moves the steering wheel or specifically indicates to change lane, then lane assist does not respond. Lane assist helps you stay safely in the right lane. Traffic sign recognition processes a variety of information. Detected traffic signs, vehicle data, as well as information from the navigation system. It constantly informs the driver about the current situation. A camera in the mirror base records traffic signs, such as speed limits and no overtaking areas. The traffic signs are displayed on the multifunction display and on the navigation unit display. Additional information is also displayed. The rain sensor notices it's starting to rain. The display shows 80 km per hour is the maximum speed in these conditions. The proactive occupant protection system provides assistance in critical situations and can reduce the consequences of a potential accident. Unexpected wet patch on a bend. The electronic stabilization program immediately detects that the golf is starting to skid. It needs to respond quickly. The system tightens the front seat belts. The windows are closed. An important precautionary measure. Otherwise, the head airbags cannot provide optimum protection. If the sliding roof is open, it is also closed. Everything turned out fine, with the Golf firmly back on track. Now the driver and front passenger seat belts are loosened, so everyone can enjoy the rest of their journey. Within the limits of the system, the blind spot monitor with rear traffic alert supports changing lanes. Radar sensors integrated in the back monitor the space behind and beside the car. If changing the lane would appear dangerous, the driver is informed by the blind spot monitor with rear traffic alert when looking into the mirror. If the driver starts to change the lane now, the blind spot monitor with rear traffic alert gives a warning with a flashing light display in the mirror. In connection with the optional lane assist, the system additionally supports by counter steering. The radar sensors integrated in the back also help to reverse out of a parking space within the limits of the system they can detect what the driver cannot see. If a vehicle is detected, the system gives an acoustic alert and the driver can stop. With this support, the driver reverses out of the parking space slowly and in a controlled manner. And if the driver does not react, 
the system can, in case of an imminent collision, reduce possible accident results by... Tight parking spaces are a challenge for everyone. Once you activate Park Assist, ultrasonic sensors check whether a parking space is large enough. 40 centimeters clearance for front and rear are enough. There's a space. The intelligent steering assistant quickly calculates the best parking maneuvers. While the system steers, the driver simply needs to operate the accelerator, brake and gears. Park Assist guides the Golf into the space with several maneuvers if needed. Park Pilot's acoustic signals for front and rear make things much easier. Getting out of a tight space can also be difficult. Park Assist needs just 25 centimeters to get you out. Once again, the distance sensors make it much easier. Bay parking spaces are also no problem for the Park Assist. While the parking assistant steers, Park Pilot indicates the end of the bay. In the dark and at speeds above 60 km per hour, Light Assist automatically switches the main beam on and off. The camera in the interior mirror constantly monitors the surroundings. The road is perfectly illuminated by switching automatically between dipped and main beam. A vehicle in front. The system detects the vehicle and automatically dips the headlights. The main beam is reactivated. The system also detects oncoming traffic. It switches off the main beam, ensuring the other vehicle is not dazzled. Lightest.